Hello Sagittarius, thank you so much for checking out this video. This is going to be a love reading for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It'll be a general love reading, so it will not resonate with everyone watching. Uh, please check out your other placements for more messages. Sometimes those can resonate more. I'm going to start with some oracle messages. So Spirit, I invite you please to bring forth messages for Sagittarius in regards to love. What does Sagittarius need to know? In regards to love huge thank you to everyone who has commented liked subscribed i really appreciate it i appreciate all of the support i read all of the comments so thank you so much all right sagittarius what messages do you have for sagittarius that one any other messages please spirit what does the sagittarius need to know in regards to love oh we got three okay Let's see what we got. Adjacent possibilities. Interesting. So options. I am going to clarify all of these. Strategy. Okay. So someone's probably looking at stra strategizing how to get, make an offer possibly, or wanting to communicate, trying to, this is all about an objective strategy, getting something done, achieving something. Um, someone's looking at their options here. Yep. To take action very interesting let's see what the action is right Sagittarius I'm super curious now all right guys whatever situation oh my gosh my crush is went flying whatever situation um we talk about today remember that time is fluid so it could have already happened to be currently happening or happen in the near future and the roles can be reversed okay so feel free to flip the rolls if they resonate more. Spirit, what messages do you have for Sagittarius? For Sagittarius, please. Do what we have. Tell me about adjacent possibilities. Let's see. What says adjacent possibilities about? For Sagittarius. Tell me more about adjacent possibilities, spirit. This is adjacent possibilities. Wow, magician reverse. Anything else for adjacent possibilities? The double reversed. What is happening? Actually, this could be this could be good. Let's see what else we can get. Thank you, spirit. Three of Pentacles. Okay, so what I'm seeing here with the Magician Reverse, usually I don't like this energy. I'll be honest. Magician Reverse to me can be somebody very manipulative in a, in a, in a low vibrational sort of way. Um, but this could also be um, sort of a block when it comes to manifesting. So something here did not work out. Something here was not manifested. Something here was... Someone possibly also used their power and it blew up in their face, um, or they tried to to create something and it blew up in their face. Um, but then I have the devil in reverse. So this to me is liberation. This to me is escaping a toxic mentality. This to me is dropping unhealthy attachments. And after that, I have the three of pentacles. So this is rebuilding, collaborating, working together. I feel like the, and I'm gonna clarify these further with a different deck, but what I see so far, because this is clarifying adjacent possibilities it's almost like someone here was trying different things that weren't working possibly because they had the wrong approach or it just wasn't the door for them you know they were trying to manifest something and it wasn't working out possibly because that's not what they were meant to manifest i feel like someone here was trapped in a, in a toxic environment um possibly um feeling stuck and so something has happened to clear that, to help you work on something else. Someone here is focused on rebuilding here. There are, there's a new door that's opening for this person. And we're gonna look a little bit further into what that might be later on. Spirit, tell me about strategy. What is strategy about? Four of Pentacles, interesting. Someone could be holding back here, holding on to something, um, possibly also keeping this to themselves. Let's see. 
What else can you tell me about strategy? Seven of Cups reverse. So there's there's clarity. Um, someone has someone's not confused anymore about what they want to do. And then there's justice. Yeah, someone's about to take action here to rebalance a situation. Possibly could be a legal matter of some sort. Um, for some of you, um, this is sign of Libra, by the way. So in Capricorn, I also have sign of Capricorn here. So you could be dealing with someone that has those those signs doesn't have to be. Um, but what I'm seeing here, someone here has made a choice. They were probably keeping something to themselves or or holding on to something here. Again, with the options, I do see this as very Seven of Cups energy here with adjacent possibilities. So I feel like there was at one point um, fogginess or confusion regarding which path to take, which decision to make. Possibly also illusions, daydreaming, someone fantasizing, right? Rather than being a little more grounded, but that seems to have changed. There's been a shift here for you, Sagittarius, or for this person that you are connecting with. Um, and there is now justice. So something fair and balanced here. A final decision of some sort. Tell me about action. What is this action? Well, way too many. What is action about here for Sagittarius? What's action about? Thank you. The moon reversed. Wow. Okay. So something's being revealed. Secrets are being revealed, coming to light. This could also be illusions again. But I'm getting more because this is with action. It's like someone has realized something here or something has come to light that's propelling someone to take action. Tell me more about action, please, Spirit. What else can you tell me about action? Yeah, Six of Pentacles. Someone wanting to make something right. Someone having reciprocating feelings for someone else. Someone wanting to make something balanced again. There's two scales here. So I feel like balance is a, is a ma major uh, thing here. And again, strategy is right at the center of this board. I feel like this decision is a strategic decision for this person. And whatever it is, I feel like it's going to work out in their favor. Tell me more about action, please. Tell me more about action. Four of Swords, healing. Someone could be wanting to heal a situation here. Someone could be wanting to... It could also be someone here has been thinking about this a lot, pondering on their next move, what their action will be. A lot of thinking here. So let's clarify these. Spirit, help me clarify these energies. Bear with me, guys. My hands are not very small. My hands are very small is actually what I want to say. Not not very small. Help me clarify these energies, please, Spirit. For Sagittarius, please. Okay, let's start over here. What's this magician reversed? What's this magician reversed? Alternatively, this could be that someone here possibly tried to manipulate a situation and it didn't go their way. Someone here was able to escape. That's for some of you. Let's see, what's this magician reversed? For others of you, this is something that did not work out. It was it was something that was not able to be manifested. Queen of Wands. Death reversed. Yeah, something here was like someone here was, was resistant to change, resistant to a transformation of some sort. Someone here possibly couldn't end something with the death card in reverse. You could be dealing with a Scorpio or a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You could be this queen of wands as well. I feel like someone here wanted to take action or this is something that was someone tried to do to you, Sagittarius, 
where they couldn't, they, they didn't want something to end, they didn't want something to transform, to change. They were resistant to change, to something ending here. I don't think it worked out for them though. Tell me more for the Magician Reversed. Yeah, no, it didn't work out for them. Here's Justice again. This could have been a legal situation or some sort of, again, I'm getting the sense of a final decision, um, a writing of like something was made right for you. This could have had something to do with uh, work or effort here because I have the Eight of Pentacles under the deck. So someone here was working very hard on something or trying to focus on themselves here. I feel like for some reason I just heard minding their business. So someone was trying to mind their own business and almost like I feel also this person was trying to move on with their life and someone was trying to hold them back. For others of you, something here didn't work out you wanted to take action you wanted to manifest something um but it didn't it didn't happen however it costs you to release or someone has been set free tell me about this devil in reverse i see the devil in reverse as someone breaking free of the chains of the unhealthy attachments they might have seven of swords so maybe someone was lying or sneaking around or trying to avoid a certain topic or communication <coughs> excuse me and you know they were trying to get away with something here and it didn't work out all it all it, and all that ended up happening is that you were able to have your freedom here you were able to let go of something Four of Pentacles reversed. Two of Pentacles reversed. Ten of Cups reversed. Very interesting. This could have had to do with a relationship or a family unit. Whatever it is, this is a emotionally draining situation. This is a an unhappy situation with the Ten of Cups. Um, someone here was either overwhelmed with their responsibilities or just unable to make a decision here, unable to make a call here. And then I think the Seven of Swords, I feel like someone decided to let go with the Four of Pentacles in reverse. Someone decided to let go of the situation. Someone made a choice. Like what, what they couldn't decide on, they were able to decide. Tell me about this Three of Pentacles. What's this Three of Pentacles about? No. Nope. What's this Three of Pentacles about? Eight of Swords. Interesting. Again, with that feeling of being trapped. Tell me more about this Three of Pentacles. I keep getting a lot of cards. We have five of cups in reverse, and then we have the four of swords and the hermit. Someone healed from the situation. Someone um, overcame. It's almost like someone healed from the situation. Someone could see the potential of something else here that they were able to rebuild now. Um, I feel like they were deep in thought about their next move here. Um, but they're also a little bit stuck in fear. Um, almost like their mind is playing games with them here. Maybe they're wondering if this is really, if they're really free or if they're really going to be able to be stable again or rebuild again. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Doesn't have to be, but this is all about withdrawing, um, being a little bit isolating. I mean, we're all kind of isolated right now, but it's somebody that has really taken the time to look deep within themselves to figure out what they're going to do. I have the world at the bottom of the deck. So someone here is definitely ending a cycle to begin something new. So let's see the strategy here. Tell me about this four of pentacles. What's this four of pentacles about? About love, queen of cups. Someone has not been able to let go of someone they care about could be a water sign here cancer pisces scorpio doesn't have to be tell me more 
about a love offer that never came, possibly. Also, Knight of Pentacles, he's kind of lazy. Um, he takes it, 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 significant delays here. This is someone that um, is not reliable. Or this is an offer that never came. Tell me about the Seven of Cups reversed for Sagittarius. This is Seven of Cups reversed. Someone made a choice here. Wow, okay. The Chariot reversed. Sign of Cancer. This is someone that was stuck. Again with the feeling stuck. There was no movement forward here. Tell me more about the Seven of Cups reverse. OMG. So I don't know if that's reverse or not. It came out sideways, but I don't know what to do with it. Okay, I'm just going to leave it in limbo. <laughs> I wasn't looking clearly, but it, it, it just fell on the, on the table like this, you know, sideways. So I'm just going to leave it like that because this is very significant to me. I feel like this is the, the shift that I've been seeing here. Something changed. Um, I feel like the wheel is in the... Oh, I just heard the wheel is currently turning. It hasn't, it hasn't stopped turning yet. It's on, it's currently turning. So we'll see. Let, let me see if I can get one more. So I feel like there's a big shift here. Um, I feel like the, it's almost like the wheel stopped this like right on its tracks. Tell me more about this seven of cups reverse. Yeah, someone's leaving a situation with the Eight of Cups. Someone realized that something was not moving forward. There was a lot of confusion, a lot of fogginess. There was someone that was not able to let go. And they they were stuck in some sort of situation here. They were, they've been released from that situation thanks to this Justice card. Something was made right. And this person's taking that as their opportunity to move on. Tell me about justice. What's justice doing here? Page of Swords. So someone's um, possibly... I was going to say someone's wanting to possibly communicate, but then I have the Eight of Wands in reverse. Again, delays. Lack of movement no communication i feel like someone here was looking for options with the page of swords almost like doing their research having conversations with certain people i feel like they're whatever they found out whatever truth or communication that's been going on has led them to a final decision or this is a final decision that has been communicated to this person, like if it was from like the legal system, for example. Um, and then here I have something stopped. What's this Eight of Wands in reverse? What's Eight of Wands in reverse? Oh, wow, the Page of Cups. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This could be two people. Okay, so I'm getting two messages. For some of you, you stop talking to somebody and 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 that has and somebody else is coming in to offer you something new. Something ended with someone else here, Sagittarius, and that has opened the door to this person to come in and make you some sort of expression of love, of emotion. For others of you, someone has realized that you've cut communication, that you've made a decision to leave, that there's been a stop to whatever someone was possibly planning or whatever happened here, and someone wants to apologize and make things right. Tell me about the moon in reverse, but something was revealed here. Tell me about the moon in reverse, please. Sign of Pisces. Wow, the tower, whoa, the tower reversed. Whatever re revelation this was, it, it was completely like shocking. It was a disaster. Six of Pentacles in reverse. 
whatever was revealed was a huge imbalance. Um, this is also someone who is possibly holding back or someone who's not giving to a situation anymore. Someone who is, this could also be someone greedy as well, but you know, it doesn't have to be always negative. Sometimes you have to hold back for your own self care. But it looks like something was rebalanced right away here. Tell me more about the moon in reverse. Wow, thank you. Wow, someone was not happy with whatever was revealed. King of Swords reversed. Someone was not happy. Whatever was revealed, it made someone very upset. Um, King of Swords um, reverse. He's he could be cruel, harsh, violent sometimes. Um, he uses words to cut, to hurt. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles. What happened here? What's the Six of Pentacles about? Six of Swords. Wow. Again with the leaving. Someone's transitioning to a more peaceful and balanced energy here. Tell me more. A more healing energy. Tell me more about the Six of Pentacles. The Fool reversed. My goodness. With the Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So this could be somebody who's not really thinking about clearly about where they're headed with the full in reverse. Why is the full in reverse here? This person can be a little foolish, thoughtless, reckless. Why is the full in reverse? So, the moon again. Okay, so I'm getting here, wow, okay, I'm getting that someone has to take a reckless leap of faith. Someone here doesn't know where they're headed. They just know that wherever they're headed is better than where they're at. So that's why I had the Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So this is somebody that's been made, an, someone may has made an offer to this person that they can't refuse. And even though it might be a little crazy, they're going to do it anyway. There's fear here. But it's not going to keep this person from healing. Tell me more about the Four of Swords. Oh, wow. Look, we got the King of Cups. Someone loving, emotionally mature, emotionally stable here. This could be you becoming more emotionally balanced. Or this could be the person that you're dealing with. This could be someone coming into your life to offer you love or compassion or just someone to lean on let's see tell me more five of swords reversed interesting so this is somebody here who has overcome who has overcome a difficult situation this is someone who has overcome uh lies disadvantages um, challenges. This person has healed from that. Tell me more for this Four of Swords. Wow. Knight of Cups reverse. Tell me more. Why is this Knight of Cups in reverse? King of Wands. Okay, so again, I'm getting the sense that there's possibly two people here. I think this this Knight of Cups reverse is from a um, this King of Wands. There might be two people here. Um, one with ulterior motives, so beware. This Knight of Cups, this is somebody that's not... They're, they're, they're emotionally... They're, they're just... Um, how do I say it? manipulative um they, they don't have their their heart is not in the right place um 
This could also be a delay of an of an offer coming in, um, a delay. But someone here wants to take action. Hmm. Why is the King of Wands here? Someone here wants to take action. Wants to, I mean, it's like they feel, oh, and then there's that Seven of Cups again. So this King of Wands could be, this person here could be a little bit of a, of a player. I have Seven of Cups. This person could have a lot of options. Um, let me move this down a little bit so you guys can see. So this person can have a, um, several options here, but what I'm seeing here is I'm seeing someone who's overcome the BS and then I see someone else wanting to come in with the same BS with the King of Wands, Seven of Cups, and then the Knight of Cups reversed. That's what I see there. I see you possibly co contemplating what's happening here with the Four of Swords, but I'm, more than anything, I see you overcoming healing from a situation, becoming more stable. And now I'm wondering, what is this Page of Cups here? What is this Page of Cups here? Is this someone giving you an apology? Tell me about this Page of Cups. What's this Page of Cups about? Judgment, okay. Anything else? This page of cups. Eight of Pentacles. This is someone who wants to work on something again, wants to revive something, wants a second chance. So this is possibly an apology here with this page of cups. And honestly, I don't know if you're going to accept them, Sagittarius. I don't know. If this is what you are, if this is an offer you're going to take seriously, um, I feel like it might be for some of you, there's two people fighting over you. For others of you, um, you're trying to decide if, you, if you're if you going to go back to the past. I don't know if a lot of you will. I feel like a lot of you struggled with the past and overcame a lot and you might want to just move on. Let's see what the romance angels have to say. For Sagittarius, please. Spirit, what messages do you have for Sagittarius, please, in regards to love? Messages do you have for Sagittarius? You deserve love. You are lovable. Getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So I'm getting that a lot of you are possibly feeling like your self-esteem has taken a hit. Some of you wonder if you deserve love, if love is ever going to come your way, if that's written in the stars for you. Um, with this getting to know each other, this could be someone who is new coming into your life and you're just starting to get to know them. And it's like you're seeing the possibilities of something else. Or this could be you and someone from the past reconnecting and getting to... My God, did I really have to drop those? Hang on. Someone from the past um, coming to maybe um, offer you something new and you are getting to know each other again. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. Interesting. So you probably already met someone new. Or you know the person that you want to be with already. You could be leaving a situation, heading towards the person that you feel is the one. I have a lot of leap cards here of leaving and healing. Anything else for Sagittarius? Playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner... Your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Interesting. I'm getting the sense you already know this person. I'm getting the sense you already have an idea of who you might want to either enter your life or re-enter your life, whichever it is. Otherwise, I'll leave it there, Sagittarius. Thank you so much for checking out this video. I hope it resonated with some of you. If it did, please let me know in the comments. I love hearing from you. Please like or subscribe if you enjoy my readings. I appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in another video. Take care.